Hello, it's Jar and Derex here again. And no, I am not by any means calling for some ban on My Little Pony or any of that bullshit. It's just, I really... I really cannot understand why something as absurd as My Little Pony has become this popular. I mean... Yes, I, I do realize we live in a culture that is obsessed with Justin Bieber and a culture that is obsessed with Miley Cyrus or whatever. But my little mother fucking pony. Okay. My little pony was started as a little girl's dolly toy. Meant for little girls to play with so they can brush their hair, okay? You know, you know, like, 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 see, like, like, it's like the little pet pony, okay? And they're brushing their hair with the hairbrush of the little pony pony. It's not supposed to be fucking cool for us adults! My little pony is for little girls between the ages of two and seven years old. I mean, yes, this is a free country. You can like what you want to like. But seriously, if you're this obsessed with My Little Pony, this is probably something you want to keep in the dark if you want to have friends who aren't utterly insane or pedophiles. Not that I'm not utterly insane, but I'm definitely not a pedophile. Okay. Just, 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 just put this into perspective for me. Why is, why are ponies that, ha that are covered in rainbows and are different colors cool to anyone, any sane human being, or at least semi-sane, okay? I mean, I could understand even liking... Fucking Powerpuff Girls, at least they do something cool, like beat up enemies. I mean, yes, they're girly, but at least they, they're girly in a cool way. But ponies just, they just have friendship problems and all this other bullshit. And the fucking theme song is so annoying. It's not even music. I mean, just, just, just explain this to me. How? I mean, I'm sorry, but a television show about super hands fighting each other would be more interesting than My Little Pony. Okay? You see, My Little Pony isn't cool on any level. If they... I know this is an opinion, but... What kind of culture, honestly, has grown men obsessed with cute little ponies? Besides Japan. Japan would probably fall in that category where they like little girly things. Like, little kitty. But this isn't Japan. In America, we're supposed to be at least semi-serious and semi-adults here. I mean, card doom, people... <laughs> I'm sorry if I offend anyone. You know, no, I'm not because you were stupid enough to come to my video. So if my opinion offends you and you're a brony, you shouldn't fucking come to my video. But obviously, people like bronies don't have much common sense to think fucking ponies are cool. Ponies that have friendship problems, at least. It, you know, you're supposed to watch something that is so... Something that's cool is something that couldn't happen in the real world. I mean, yes, you couldn't have ponies talking in the real world, but something that could happen in the real world that you would actually want to do. I'm sorry, but who in their right mind would fucking want to have ponies that are all pretty and have friends in the real world? At least watch something cool like, you know... At least watch Walking Dead. You know, it's kind of a cool idea. You know, if you had to actually like, survive and stuff. That would be something that could be cool to do in the real world. Maybe scary, but at least cool. 
but my little fucking pony. Just. I mean. I just. I don't know what else there is to say. I mean, if you honestly like this shit, watch it, but. Just don't fucking bring it to work. Don't bring it to class. Don't bring it to meetings. Don't. Keep it in your little pony cult rooms. Keep it away from the rest of society because it has no place in normal society. No place. In fact, this napkin would be more interesting topic to me than My Little Pony. Unless if the topic was ripping on how stupid the viewers of My Little Pony are. This napkin... Because, you know, actually, I do like Subway. It's pretty decent food. Honestly, over here in Kent, food's a little too expensive, and Subway is actually the cheapest food you can get on campus. Yeah, that's how expensive our food is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, see, like, a little jar, like, little jar of gravy, you know. Oh, sorry, I dropped some. This little jar of gravy, when it's full of gravy, at the grocery store here, the local Kent grocery store, that they have a monopoly on us because we have to buy their meal plan. This little jar costs like five or six dollars, and this is all the gravy you get for five or six dollars. You know it's not worth that much. You can buy a bullion cube and get a whole pot of gravy for like two cents. <laughs> I mean, things are so overpriced, and we don't have a choice because we have to buy the Kent meal plan. But this is a side issue. But seriously, people, you My Little Pony fans, I'm not trying to change you. I'm really not trying to understand you either just just keep it away from me please don't bring it up in conversations about things unless if you know that there are other bronies you're talking with don't talk about it to normal people not saying I'm normal but semi-normal people thank you it's been Jar and Derek's see you all around or something like that <laughs>